Gabe Ronaldo here and I'm going to be reviewing a Black Star Custom and it's from the Batman Animated Series. And here's the box and let's get to it. Comes with a bag, this is number 54. 54. Awesome. Okay. I'm going to open this guy right over here. And look at that. Nice. Black star. And then we're going to fold it down. It comes with Batman's cape. A deer collector. Comes with another cape, which is from the from the animated series. Comes with Robin's cape, and this guy's right here is uh, a Lego me. <laughs> I put him to the side over here. Comes with Batman. Here's the inside of the box. Comes with a QR code to his Instagram and stuff, which is really cool. Now we're just gonna close this guy. And now we're gonna review the minifigures. Let's start off with Batman. Before we get started guys, I just wanna let you guys know my Batman helmet was actually chipped which was kind of unfortunate when I got the package. Also, Robin's hair was also chipped as well. And I'm going to contact him trying to get another helmet and hair. On to the video. And here is Batman starting off with his custom cowl. He is double printed on his face. Uh, his legs are not double molded. They're actually black legs just printed. He does have pr printing on his side of his uh, torso and all over his body, which is amazing. This minifigure is highly detailed. So here's the side. And then we're gonna go to the back. And then we're gonna go back to the side. Sorry for the uh, wobbly, crooked, uh, <laughs> lazy wannabe Susan. I, had, I did have a lazy Susan on me, so I had to build one out of Lego bricks. And now we're gonna be showing you the custom capes. Okay, so I just wanted to show you guys without his helmet. It does come with uh, double uh, printed uh, pad printing on both sides of the head. This is the more angry expression. Uh, he does have this uh, signature um, name on his head. Uh, I don't know if you guys see it above the white eyes section. And then on the other side, it's just a normal he has. So this is the cape. I'm just gonna put the helmet back on. I am vengeance. I am the knight. I am Batman. Which is pretty cool. As we've seen in the animated series. Now next cape. Okay, so the cape was kind of interesting. Um, uh, one of the biggest downsides, I guess, for this cape is actually you gotta take out the arms for the actual uh, minifigure to fit. If you don't take out the arms, you risk uh, scratching the actual arms and the actually detailed uh, printing from it. Sorry, you can't. So yeah, in order for to put the uh, this cape, you gotta take out the arms which is unfortunate because this is by far my favorite uh, cape. And still looks cool though, but yeah, you have to take out the arms for it, so. I am vengeance. Now on to Robin. Here we have Robin. Does come with a custom hair, which is awesome. Same thing, printing all over the place. The legs are uh, actually red legs. They're just printed as well. Here's the side. The arms, I'm assuming they are um, just regular peach colored arms, just printed as well. 
as you can see in the legs, they are red. Oh, that's a little bit better, yeah. And then, we're just, oh, sorry, on the side. He does come with a double expression as well. Sorry about that. <laughs> and a custom cape. The capes are uh, ABS or resin printed. I'm assuming they're resin printed. They feel like that. They're not rubbery. I thought they were going to be rubbery. Here's the cape. It's also Robin's double expression. A little sad face. Smirk. And then the hair. I give this whole set a solid 8, only because the cape does not fit the arms as well as the torso for Batman, and also because of the chipping situation. Other than that, the details are amazing. They are simple and it goes all around the whole body, which is amazing. One last thing, for Batman's helmet, I feel like it's very squished towards the bottom portion of the helmet and very thin, which kind of leaves it very sensitive and fragile in my opinion. That's it for this video guys. If you really like this video, please comment, subscribe, like, and share. And turn on that notification because I might be posting more of these custom minifigures as they come. Um, I might be even posting some custom mocks that I found which is pretty cool. I love this tumbler. Um, it is minifigure scale, so which is awesome. And yeah, I'll be doing more videos of these customs and I'm really excited and I'm very fortunate to be one of these lucky ones to collect these minifigures. And yeah, see you in the next video.